In this video, SPSS Lab 1 will show you how to create a new data set, add the variables, and also add the, the values into the set. When you open SPSS, you want to choose File, New, and Data. This will bring up a blank, um, kind of like a matrix. And what you'll see is uh, the different um, columns that you can add, uh, that you can work with for each variable. You want to make sure you're in variable view, and then you want to take your dummy data sheet and going across the top, you want to add each of the names to each one of the the rows. So it's an ID. And then we're going to add PER for period. And you'll have to click on each of these, gender, ethnicity, Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, Q5, ELA, SEM1, SEM2, Homework 1, and Homework 2. When you're finished with that, <clears throat> you can toggle over to the data view. And now, again, using your dummy data sheet, you're going to add all of the data. When you add the data for the very first time, what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to code everything by number. So the ID is obviously going to be uh, 01. And, and make sure you put 01. Uh, this will be important later for sorting and, and those kinds of things. For period, it's going to be 1 or 2. Now for gender, you need to look at your coding sheet on the da uh, dummy data sheet. And female equals 2 and male equals 1. I want you to add the number, not the name, uh, spell out the name. So for the very first participant here, uh, she was a female, so I'm going to add two. And same thing with ethnicity. Uh, this particular participant was Caucasian, and Caucasian is coded one. And then you go all the way across this column, and you add each of the pieces of data. Four is four, five is one, and so forth, and so on. And then you would come back to the beginning, and you would do participant number 02. And you would just continue across. When you're finished with this process, you want to go up here, choose Save As. And you can save it to the desktop, or if you have a thumb drive, that's fine. And save it whatever you want to call it. You can call it Data Set 1, Dummy Data 1. Um, but make sure that you save it as, and make sure you know where you save it to. And that ends uh, this second video that's part of SPSS Lab 1. This one is called Creating the Data Set, Adding Variables and Values.